say, and one of the ones I want to investigate is yeah. your period at Love Sport Radio. <laughs> yeah, now, correct. Yeah. Sport, he had a slightly longer period. Now, this was Love Sport. <laughs> for those that don't know, Love Sport Radio <laughs> is run by a man yes. who is quite a regular guest, actually, on this programme. Yeah. A certain Kelvin McKenzie. Yes. What was it like working for Kelvin McKenzie? Well, well he had a great time. I, um, <laughs> I got sacked. <laughs> well, the reason I got sacked was one day he, uh, he called me into the office and he went, Now, I've heard a rumour, he said, that uh, you know nothing about sport. Yeah. He said, what the hell are you doing working on a love sport radio? Yeah. I said, well, you know, I'm trying to try come. A couple of months later, I was sacked. Yeah. Were you? That but, was that. But he sacked, I mean, he, he sacked know. everyone around me. He did say, I was the last man. Me, myself and Patrick Christie's were the last. Patrick Christie's were the actual were. last people. You closed the, 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 the radio. We closed the radio. <laughs> they closed it, yes. In fact, I remember Kelvin once saying to me, I love sacking people. Yeah. <laughs> well, he yeah. was, you know. He said, he Sorry, was, Kelvin. He was the tyrant of Fleet Street, wasn't yeah. he? And yeah. obviously, and I didn't listen. He, was, he, he, he relished was great, in it. Yeah. But you've, I mean, what you've done with your with your fame with all of this, mm. and you yes. wrote, you wrote a nice nice little ditty about me that ditty. we played a few yeah. weeks ago. Yeah. Yes. But it's kind of the corporate world now, is it? Is this is this where it's at? Yeah. Now? I mean, a lot of the. Mm. Strangely enough, we, we were sort of saying our, our royalties for these songs. You know, we we were lucky. dried up a bit. We, they dried up around about two thousand eight, <laughs> two thousand nine, because of the download market and the file sharing. So. We found ourselves doing more gigs than mm. ever mm. and to earn the same money that you were getting, you know, a few years previous. But mm. now the corporate world, really, I mean, we've just done the World Cup. We, we went out and we was meant to go to Qatar to do it. And then we was offered the gig to do it in Dubai, yep. which is a fantastic place. It's full of expats. Uh, it's brilliant. Yeah. It was I, fantastic. I, I didn't think that I was going to like Dubai. And mm. I love it there. <laughs> he loved it. <laughs> I really did. I love it. I can't wait to go back. Yeah. 